Manorahim. Welcome to our YouTube channel. In this session, we are going to discuss about the topic factors need to become a mechanical design engineer. Most of the students have this common doubt. We are going to discuss in detail. There are four important factors to become a successful mechanical design engineer. First one is design softwares. Second one is material knowledge. Third one is manufacturing knowledge or manufacturing possibilities. Fourth one is GDND. GDND is nothing but geometrical dimensions and tolerance. We are going to discuss in detail about one by one. First one is design softwares. A design engineer must have a knowledge of any one of categories of these softwares CAD, CAM, or CAE. First one is CAD. CAD means computer aided designing. In computer aided designing, we have a lot of softwares. Some of the important softwares are AutoCAD, SOLIDWORKS, CREO, CATIA, NX or UniGraphics, etc. Our next category is CAM, Computer Aided Manufacturing. The main principle of computer aided manufacturing is to generating the programming language such as a machine code or geometrical code. Among the CAM, we have a two softwares, Master CAM, NX CAM and Extrator. Last one is CAE, Computer Aided Engineering. The main principle of all these softwares is to calculate the withstanding load, temperature, vibration, etc. Some of the CAE softwares are ANSYS, Naston, Hypermesh, Cosmos, MATLAB, etc. Then second one is Material Knowledge. Design engineer must have a material knowledge because after designing a product, he has a responsibility to specify the type of material which is suitable for our designed product. So design engineer must have a knowledge about the type of materials, for example, metals, non-metals, polymers, etc. And then you have a knowledge in a property of materials such as ductility, brittle, strength, hardness, etc. Design engineer have a responsibility to apply the material for our designed component by considering the various factors by load, temperature, vibrations, etc. And the third one is manufacturing knowledge. It is a most important factor a design engineer must have a manufacturing knowledge. How do you achieve the shape of designed product or component which we design in 3D software? While we design a product in a software, we are must consider it is practically possible to manufacture. And another important one is, after designing a product in a software, we have to consider which type of the machines are available in our industry to manufacture the product, which machine is very useful to achieve the shape of the product. So, a design engineer must have a manufacturing knowledge. Some of the machines under manufacturing types are first one is machining CNC, VMC, etc., then forging and the forming in sheet metal operations and the casting. So, last one are GDNT. GDNT is nothing but geometrical dimensions and tolerance. While the machining process, we cannot able to achieve the 100% accuracy. So we have to provide the permissible deviation during the manufacturing process. So design engine must have a knowledge of GDNT symbols which was created in a drafting sheet. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe in our channel. Inshallah we will meet in next video.